Hey planty friends, welcome back to another new planty video. Today we're gonna go to Home Depot. Now I know I said I was not gonna do a lot of plant shopping videos, but we ended up going to the flea market. It was a really, really fun, busy day with my brother and my boyfriend. So I always show you guys a haul because I got some goodies from the flea market, but that'll be at the end of the video. So let's go plant shopping at the Home Depot. Alrighty, so we're at the Home Depot. They have some green for the dungeons. We're not even having a lot of those, but some Hoyas, but you guys, I just can't believe what I found. And then these alocasias are extremely full. Sometimes you can find a sport variegated one or a variegated uh, alocasia. And you just gotta like really, really look through. But, oh my god, I'm yelling. I'm sorry. I just sometimes forget. I get really, really excited. Look at this one. That looks a little bit right, but that's not variegated. We have some other ones. <gasps> Is this the new one? Oh my goodness. Now I won't get it because, well, I already bought some plants and I'll show you guys. I was in the flea market. I know I said I was gonna take a break on plant shopping, but my brothers came over for a sleepover. It was super duper fun. And then today, today, we went to the flea market and I'll tell you guys more later on and I'll show you what I got. I did go some plants, so. You guys are gonna get a haul at the end, but look at this. I saw this and I was like, oh my gosh. Now I'm probably gonna pass. <gasps> and it's the old price, it's $15.98. It is so pretty and lush. Beautiful. But it's okay. I can usually get this into the smaller one, so I'm not really kind of missing out. I always feel like I'm missing out when I find a really, really cool plant, but. I just gotta control myself. What I tell myself is like, I, I love this, it's like a little jungle. <laughs> I'm like, if I didn't came, I would have never got that plant. <gasps> you know, if I didn't know. Oh my God, look at this one, this is cute too. A Christmas Cactus 1298. And then they have a queen, a Hoya queen. Look at this, and they have more plants outside. I'm currently inside, this is so pretty. And it's 1998. The new prices are twenty ninety eight. It's just a dollar increase, but hey, you know that adds up within a year. So this is really, really nice, really, really good. Um, they have more plants inside, so I'll show y'all what they have. But like inside, I'm gonna walk around. I feel so weird recording in public sometimes. I've been doing this for super duper long, and I'm still getting used to it, but. Look at these beautiful anthuriums. I love these like flowers, they're like chocolatey. And there are four, $18.98. That is not a bad price, beautiful anthuriums. A lot of orchids, you can see the prices now. $12.98 for the big ones, $16.98 for the smaller ones. And they have more plants over here. <gasps> oh my goodness, look how variegated this PPP is. Really, really nicely barricaded. They also have the new ones. Well, not new, but they're looking a lot better. And they're in these nice self watering planters, which I probably will pull out and put this plant in a terracotta because ZZs are just like the chameleon ZZ, the raven, they have tubers and it's pretty easy to overwater them if you treat it like a tropical house plant. But like this one's really, really barricaded and it's so, so pretty. These are really good. It's better. That looks so much better than mine. Look at those in the back. Those are pretty cool. They have a nice looking, massive Birkin for $14.98. And lots of golden potos. And I think they have more plants on the other section. <laughs> this is pretty cool. I always want to see from shopping videos like walking, but I'm in public and I don't want to record somebody like imagine somebody walks by. Like that'll be awkward. Alrighty, we're outside and it looks really, really promising. They have the massive... Okay, I thought I was recording, but I guess I wasn't. So, I was showing the Wabra Queen Potos. Look how big this leaf is. I don't know what they're feeding it. And it's really, really cheap. It's pretty big. Oh, the lights are being turned on. 1998 Queen Potos. And then there's this Costa Farm one right next to, I mean above, and it is $15.98. Mm, 
not bad. I haven't checked. Usually I like to like walk around and see what they have first, but I kind of want it to be like, a, you know, I was just getting impatient. I want to record already. This is also the same location where I found my variegated, well, Monstera Aurora, which is a pretty cool find. I'll start looking at the camera because I'm like looking out and I need to calm down. Lots of tiny plants. We have some ivies, peace lilies. This one, which is new. Yeah, what do y'all think about this one? $7.98. Pepperonias. What is this? Purple waffle plant. Cool. How much is it? $9.98. Small vermilions. And these are going for $7.98. These are really, really full. These are 20. Pretty cool. Lots of tiny plants. Drancina, Begonia. I did saw some pretty cool succulents over there. <laughs> Try not to move too fast. So we'll check it out in a bit. Golden photos. Birkins. These are for fifteen dollars. Uh, yeah, fourteen ninety eight by Burgro. Is that how you pronounce it? By Gora. By Goro. Beautiful Drancina. Is this from Costa? Yeah, wow, it's from Costa Farm. I always forget. I feel like it's just, it's its own company. Pretty foliage. Lots of aglonemas for the same price. Look, it's overwatered. Look at that. Really, really pretty. The Fambacias. These birds in this front look insane. It's not bad. Evergreens, ooh, fifteen ninety eight. It's pretty big. About to blues. I don't see the elbow. It is sunny eyes. Nice big leaves. Caladians. Eyes. These are going for $19.98. This one's pretty cool. I feel like the quality is pretty bad, I'm sorry. Oh shoot, that's huge. A little bit of coal damage. Ooh, look at that. I know it's like an outdoor plant, but it's pretty. Five ninety-eight. Ornamental curl white. Pretty foliage. These palms twenty-five. And it's putting out new leaves. Pretty cool. There's some more allocations over there. I gotta look for some sports or barely get it once. 
that's huge snake plants different back oh they do oh crap this one looks insane oh my god i think i might sn oh, dang, it's stop it because i know they're gonna put up more i really really do hope so do i need it right now no but this is kind of heavy too so actually oh this is is this actual ceramic because i know they change yeah oh it's still legit ceramic 1998 because i know they started changing it to plastic wow this one looks really really good i'm not gonna take it i want to i really really do but i know look at that i'm pretty sure they're gonna offer more <gasps> poor little plant oh that one was so big look at that oh, and it's the actual ceramics which is really exciting. They're heavy. Oh, I kind of just wanted to get cutting, but I know I would never do that. I know where I promote it, but a little bit, just like a little west stick. That's all I need. <laughs> Girl, they're heavy. Monstera Perus, Global Greens. You know, it gives it a better perspective when I'm looking through the, through the, the camera, through the phone. Because usually I just look out and I notice that I move the, the phone too, too fast when I'm editing. And I'm like, I really got to start seeing what I'm recording. And it helps a lot. <laughs> I just want to show you how pretty these leaves are. They also have illustrations, which is pretty cool. Oh, a thumbnail girl. Hello. Hold on. Let me see. It's so pretty. This is I'm literally so tempted. Like, and then oh, this leaf is just so good. You can see the little the fenestrations, which is pretty cool. The little holes in the leaves. It's just like little micros. Kind of looks like damage, but it's not. And then let's look at the alocasias. Wait, I think I see a sport. See, whenever I see these. I feel like it's a sport, but it's just damage. They're still really, really pretty. Like this one looks really, really good. These are the actual plastic ones. Like it's pretty lightweight. And if you tap it, ooh, it's glitching. You can kind of hear the difference. So why is it glitching? Wait, is this something? <laughs> Let me see if I can. Yeah, no. Because I've been seeing on Facebook, they're finding a lot of these that are like sport. I don't, I don't know if that's what you call it, but they're just variegated. Look how big this huge leaf. Oh, this one looks really, really good. I don't know why it's glitching. See, do you see that? That's just water deposit, but like, that's what they'd be looking. Sport or a variegated allocation. Oof. Lots of aglonemas. $26.98. Even the rubber trees. Pretty Calatheas. You know, they do have a new Aglonema Coastal Farm. Kind of looks like this, but this is the Golden Photo.
think that's it. I kind of want to take that, um, they didn't got the name, the elbow one. This is what I got to keep playing with. Pepperonias. Fetonia. Friendship plants, peacefully. I well, like they a lot nicer to put them in the small pots. Trancinas. Yeah. Oh, I forgot to show y'all the succulents. Seems like they're, they're gonna go and add my plants. <sighs> that is so cool. Okay, kind of reset the video. I'm hoping that it's a little better. What's uh, 1998? It's the Epipariam. See, I knew it had Albo. Epipariam Pinatum Albo by Costa Farm. It's a really pretty plant. All right, let's see if we can go to the. Oh, they have more para acá. These are the proven winners. Monstera. Really, really pretty. The Alocasia. Uh, 29.98. Mythic Alocasia. I cannot pronounce that. Calatia Orbifolia. The Tritoscantia feeling flirty. This is a really, really pretty one. Prince of Orange. 19.98. Oh, <laughs> a little dog sign. And the rest of they be selling these. Smaller ones. Neon Portos. Some hanging baskets. You guys, the quality is so bad. I've been updating my phone. I don't know. Apple be shady, girl. Let's go to the succulents and cactus section. Uh, I feel like it's just a light thing. Why is it choppy? <laughs> Is this what y'all see? Like all my videos, when I do plant shopping videos. Does it chop? Ooh, what are those? What are, ooh, look at that. That's pretty. What's your name? That's the name. Really pretty. And I believe twelve ninety eight. Pretty cool, and they have these big ones. Really, really pokey. Twenty six ninety eight. Ooh, look at all those pretty colors. Look at that. You know what? If, if y'all tell me this is what y'all see. Um, oh, a string of pearls. There was a bunch. This is the only one. <laughs> My phone just crashed. I don't know why. Oh, it's not placed correctly. String of pearls. I believe there are 12. Well, there is another one. I just saw it right now. <sighs> Put it right there. Yeah, I think I got it. Oh, look at that. That is so cheap. $7.98. You yeah, remember when these were so expensive? There is another one right there. But I think that's it. Alrighty, y'all. So that album was literally so pretty. The album, Epipariam, that's what you call it. But I'll show you guys a little haul. 
my boyfriend spoiled me today you guys and he got me all these cute things so i'm gonna show you really fast now it's just not plant related everything else is but this is not and i already put it on because i wanted to show it to my mom we ended up dropping my brothers off and we ended up seeing my mom and my stepdad so i well he got me this shirt it's los tacos it's like a little lo loteria thingy it was so cute it was only for 11 dollars insane and then he got me and my mom some planters so i went back and picked this one out i really really do and this is traders village by the way i don't know the address but just go on google maps and put traders village it's in san antonio texas highly recommend it and this is lady that sells in this guy too lots of these really really cute i'm not kind of sure what it's called but it's gorgeous and i think it's from mexico kind of like gives it off it's just so pretty i gave my mom the blue one because i think she has a plant that's pretty blue and i think it'll look pretty with hers and it has some flowers too and i got another green one because i already have a green one but i wanted another one because green looks so good with green like green plants love it so it was they're 12 dollars each but if you get two it's for 20. and then the, the other last the other two things that i got you guys hey baby is this massive peace lily girl let me tell you how much it was for so these were for 15 dollars each or two of the plants that she had in a group for 20 dollars so my boyfriend let me get this massive piece lily for 10 dollars look how big it is it's a little bit damaged because it was in the back of the seat and we we're driving kind of crazy i will quarantine these plants just to make sure because you never know but they had so many amazing plants in love look at this <laughs> i'm like so excited to like shine that i'm gonna put a grill light in the planty room and i mean in the bathroom and they're gonna be set in the bathroom to quarantine also i'm like there so i can see them daily multiple times a day and that's where i like to have my bathroom as like the hospital or like the quarantine section and then the, uh, the other plant that i got for ten dollars you guys is this massive white butterfly syngonium it was 15 but if you get like two for 10 each, I'm literally so lucky. And she has so many amazing plants. Now again, we were driving, so this broke off. I'm not mad though. I can literally propagate this and have a little tiny one. This would be so cute in its own little terracotta planter. Well, not in this one, because this one's too cute. Well, that's not a bad idea. But I'll propagate this in water, really, really fun. But this is so huge. I think I did saw scale on one of the leaves, but I didn't sell it in everything else. I will check it though. And again, this will be in the restroom for like a couple days to inspect because we never know. They could also be in the soil. You always got to check on the plants, especially when we get them in like nurseries or like I'm guessing the flea market too. Because in the big box stores, they usually use pesticides in the nurseries, but there's still a possible chance you can get some pests. But this is insane. Like literally, this is amazing. So my boyfriend is amazing guys and he got a lot of collectibles which is pretty pretty cool he's collecting a lot of figures from godzilla and stuff like that but i'm pretty sure it'll be cool for me to show you that and houseplant tours but that is basically it for today thank you so much for watching sending positive advice to each and every single one of you guys and i'll see you in the next one bye